Hi everyone and welcome back to Arctic RC and today we are doing a review for Elephant.no one of my favorite stores in Norway to buy RC equipment and so on. The plane we are going to review today is the FW190, the Fokker Wolf. Uh, beautiful scale warbird, 1.2 meter wingspan, 40 amp ESC. Um, it has retracts, flaps, navigation lights. And it comes as an RTF, uh, that means that you have the radio, battery, charger and everything. So it's almost ready to fly uh, with some assembly first, of course. The wings, uh, or the main wing comes pre-assembled with the wires and everything. And here you can see it. Uh, a lot of details. And as you can see, you have... Uh, built-in flaps, you have the ailerons and you have the retracts. The main fuselage is quite big and you really love the nose of these ones. Uh, beautiful uh, detailed uh, fuselage. Uh, on top here you have a plastic hatch with plenty of room for your receiver or in this case the receiver is also, uh, already installed. You have uh, the uh, battery uh, compartments, which is big. The battery that follows the plane is the 3 cell 2200 milliamp battery. It should slide easily in here. Just you have to just remove the ESC a little bit. Uh, it slides right in place. Uh, you have the room for a bit bigger battery. You can also modify the battery compartment so that you can fit perhaps uh, 3000 milliamp or so on but we are not going to talk about that now because we are going to test the plane first and then we're going to check out what types of battery you can use together with it. But recommended and sent from the factory it's 3 cell 2200 milliamp. You also have a 6 channel radio that comes with this RTF kit. Uh, you have a uh, switch for the retracts, switch for the flaps and those common ordinary four channels as rudder, elevator, ailerons and throttle of course. The radio also comes with a manual that explains how to rebind it if you have to do that. Uh, usually they are bind in the factory so that you don't have to think about it but if you don't get any connections uh, between the radio and the receiver you can just check out the manual very easy manual and it also helps you with other settings this radio uh, comes also with a uh, mode 1 or mode 2 option and the option of delta wing if you're going to use it for a wing battery charger for two and three cell battery manual for the airplane everything you need to know about the plane the CG and so on it comes with a scale spinner plastic and of course a three bladed propeller and you also have a little bag of tools to assemble the plane. The horizontal stabilizer. So there's not much more to say right now. I'm going to assemble the plane and we're going to take some photos and do some filming and we'll go back uh, right back to the review. So we are done assembling the Fokker Wolf 190. A beautiful plane with a lot of scaled details. I'm uh, not going to talk too much about the plane now before we go out and uh, test flight but I'm going to show you uh, the bottom of it so that you can see the retracts and so on. The beauty of this plane is that you have the scale retracts and you of course have the split flaps uh, which I uh, really really like and enjoy. Beautiful. I see you on the airfield. Ok, 
Okay, hi everyone. We are at the airfield with the uh, Focke Wolf uh, 190 uh, maiden flight with the original radio from the RTF kit. It's snowing, so we have to just get this done because the next days are going to be like hell here in Mayam. So uh, cross our fingers. Let's do the maiden. Okay. Nice. Take one uh, retract. Beautiful. Did you get it? Yep, I think so. I'm going to get this <laughs> over the water. Nice, great. Yeah. Um, with a bit of trimming at the uh, beginning, and now she's really, really docile. But I, as I was saying in uh, the inbox review, very little input on the radio. Let's go for a landing. <laughs> 